All right, guys, how you doing? Chris Ignato here, and um, I don't know if I've shown you this before, but this is uh, what the eggs from Chinese and European praying mantises look like. Okay, they're each a little different, but they're really different from Carolina mantises. Just a very different type of egg case. See that? So within that is possibly two to three hundred eggs. And probably sometime next May or June this will hatch and all those babies will come out out of the side, usually out of the bottom though. Okay. And this meadow, I just brought a whole bunch of kids here. This meadow is home to tons of mantids and stuff. That's why I brought them here. I knew we'd find a bunch of praying mantises and stuff because meadows have a lot of flowers, a lot of goldenrod and stuff, and it's great habitat for insects and things. And of course, praying mantises want to be where the food is. So, I'm sure we can find some. See if I can get out of the shadow, get my shadow out of the way. Um, I don't know if I have enough time, but there's always mantises here at this time of year. In fact, I see one. Yep, there's one. I wasn't sure if that was a mantis or not. Okay. That's one. Probably a female. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Well, that's one. Are there any others? There's always mantises here. No, oh, there's another one. Lighting's a little intense right now. There's another female. She's probably about to make some eggs. Fetch. I think she already did. Her abdomen looks like it's... I don't know how to explain it. But it looks like she was gravid and made an egg case. So right around here is probably an egg case. 